Welcome everyone, this is TG Ace of Hearts. I am playing... Well, I did not want to save. <laughs> I am playing a newer game called Candle uh, from Merge Games and Teku Studios. Um, gotta remember the controls here. There we go, that's my uh, inventory. Nope, that's jumping. A piece of bark with a curious shape was peeling off what was left of the tree. At the moment, Teku had no interest in it. I barely made that jump. Um... So, since it's raining, and I just got to this act, I do not have, this is the second act, um, I don't have my little candle power, which I'm kind of bummed about. I'm going to keep hitting the wrong thing. There we go. So we brought the arm down. So I need to be quick about that. I was close. Closer than I was the first time. Okay, here we go. Maybe I can run up and jump up this side. There we go. Now will it automatically fling me? Oh! I have to Okay. Oh, and I die. That was not good. Okay, and I didn't run over quick enough, so... There. There we go. There we go. I got stuck in a plant. And something flew me somewhere. I got an achievement for the sticky plants. Oh, and I, what the heck? Okay, so now I know that that's not a good thing. I think I got... I don't know where I got blown back to. Well, obviously I got blown back to the beginning. I don't have fire, so I can't light anything up. Let's 
Let's move forward, see what I can find. Oh, it's a save. We'll save. Oh, dude! Rude monkey! Okay, so the monkey just killed me. So we don't mess with the monkey. Okay, so that sends him up there. We jump. We're not going to play with the monkey. Don't touch the monkey. So he's a... I don't know if he's afraid of fire. Yeah, I don't really want to... Oh, this, this monkey's crying. So we, we can talk to it. Okay, so lost the baby monkey. So now we have to find a baby monkey. The poor mother monkey had lost her baby. Maybe Teku could help her find it. Maybe. And the monkey just squished me. I'm gonna die if I jump in there, right? Oh, if I fall straight in, I do. And I died over there doing something. Um. Okay, I love the graphics in this game. They're very beautiful. <laughs> okay. See what happens if I have that on there when I open it. Maybe I can fall down and not die. I doubt it. Oh, I fell down on the wrong side. Oh, I gotta go down on the left side. That makes a lot more sense. Not really, but... Okay. 
But if I go down on the left side, then there's a little ledge. Not good. We'll just block that hole up. Who knows what it's good for? And I need fire. Of course I need fire. Drops down right on top of you and squishes you. And of course it doesn't save it. But I'm wondering if you can just hide behind the monkey. We'll try that. We're not going to do the whole, uh... I should have just actually stayed back there instead of turning around. And I should have actually used the... the left trigger to run. Jump, monkey, jump! Oh, and I didn't grab it. Nope. I went too quick. Come on. It's like, you know, trying to figure out the pattern. Just doesn't want to jump up. Should bob one more time. What the heck? It didn't grab it again. Try one more time. If not, I'm going to kick the monkey in the knee. There we go. A high temperature makes it react in a strange way. So, I know some place that has a high temperature. And remember, 
remember to go down on this side so I don't die. screwed up that jump. Doesn't matter what game it is, I just can't jump. So my problem is, is I still need a fire. And there's fire right up here the right of the mama monkey. But I will save so I don't have to redo that whole uh monkey business. Now, if I could figure out how to deal with how to get past the mama monkey up here. So I'm just going to get the story again. And there's no way to jump up there. So we'll go back to the first page, or first area. is is the sticky plants I figured it out and I went too far. I actually made a jumping sequence. It's a good thing I'm streaming this because it will end up being saved on a, you know, on this stream and then it'll go to YouTube and it'll be like, yes, proof I can jump. No, 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 no. I was able to jump once. I did it once. And now for the next 47 minutes of the stream, I'll try to re recreate my amazing feat of jumping.
I don't know what you are, but I don't like you. Oh! Dang it! I jumped over the hand! breaks that. Oh, come on! Maybe I have to jump. Maybe I have to jump from that other onto it. We'll see. At least I've got... this part down, for the most part. But maybe I have to jump from... the top of this... onto the hand. You know, because it gives me just that little bit more height. Ladder. In that state, those pieces of fruit were of no use to him. In that state? What? Are the pieces of fruit in California? Those pieces of fruit were of no use to him. Okay, the pieces of fruit light up. Teko couldn't go on. It was too dark. Yeah, if I had... You know, they lit up once. Don't tell me I jumped all the way up here for nothing. Oh, wait. Maybe they just randomly light up? Oh, see, this has something to do with it. I don't know what. I'm gonna regret doing this. Geronimo! Hey, I did it. I regret nothing. I have the power of fire.
Oh! I had to use the... Once you actually get fire in a level, it's really useful because you can do all sorts of things, light dark areas, which, you know, obviously the fruit wasn't ripe enough, and that doesn't do anything. Um, Teko couldn't go on. It was too dark. What do you mean it was too dark? Did I use all of my candle power? Don't tell me I used my candle power. Now let's see if this opens up now and I can throw the fruit down. Nope. Do I have to relight my candle? Yep. Normally, I shouldn't have to relight a candle. No doubt this was the baby. And we found the baby monkey. The monkey. <laughs> but to be able to take it to its mother, Teku needed something to transport it safely. I need something to tra Seriously, who has a monkey trans a monkey stroller? And my son is raising his hand. That is because he is a monkey. I have a feeling what I need is up there, and I'm not going to be able to reach it. Oh, I didn't want to put that out. Okay, so now I've got to figure this out while I'm up here, because if I go down, I think I'm going to end up dying. It's not going to let me jump there. Um... Yeah, and you can only use certain items in certain places. Because the ladder's gone. Okay, we have now lit the torch. There we go. Oh, I just came out the thing's mouth. That's kind of gross and disgusting. Oh, and Sweet. I have a little teleporter back and forth. Is 
So let's do this quick. That just opened up those because I knew the thing was going to put those out. The rain was going to put the my little flame out. So now maybe Now we'll light that so we can come back and oh there's a guy down here and stuff in the trees all stuff that shall kill me on the ground there was a girl digging in the mud she was using a small spade to collect mushrooms which she then put into her backpack she was so focused that for the moment Teku saw no reason to bother her Teku could see a sort of basket floating in the well. The voice of the narrator, I swear, is Anthony Hopkins. I'm waiting t for him to, you know, say he's going to eat my liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti. On that part of the ground, the earth was very damp and disturbed. It would be easy to dig there with the right tools. On that part of the ground... Okay. Yes. The darkness it... was immense. Teku would need his candle to be burning to go on. make the super long jump up top but here with the evil bats I about die nope didn't reveal anything to be adders that were growing out of the tree a bit disgusting udders from a tree a choice I am milking a tree. It wouldn't surprise me if there is a rhyme or a reason to this. Got to be a reason. Okay, someone's going to end up having to tell me which udder I need to milk first. I know, that's sad. Oh, and my candle goes out right before the I get to the... was immense. Okay. Teku would need his candle to be burning to go on. Maybe she will tell me. Tamal. 
What the pinyan? Okay, she wants some psychedelic Kawi? mushrooms. The young explorer traveled all over the world in search of the most unique mushrooms. To get her to help him, Teku would have to find a mushroom with pink spots. Okay, so I've got the basket which I can use for a monkey stroller. Because, why not? Teko couldn't go up. Um, it was too dark. Yes, 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 I get it. That's the interesting thing about this game is it's like one puzzle after another. Oh, and I lost my light. Oh shoot, that was stupid. There we go. Oh, it that it's not gonna matter. I forgot I had to cross, go in front of the rain there. Trying not to touch, you know, that gorilla. Excuse me, is this your baby? And she gets her baby back and she starts chucking it up the in the air. The mother monkey offered to help Teku climb up to the treetops. I mean, that seems kind of silly and dangerous. No. Come on. No. Quit get. Okay, I don't want to keep getting on the ladder there, folks. There we go. My heart's going pum 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 pum. Is it gonna fall? And go am I gonna die? But I didn't. We've done a few things. It's time to save. What's in the cave? It's R O U S S. Once again, jumping. Because why not? <laughs> Two things to land on, and I miss them both. Hey, it's a Teku.
That man was pounding a piece of metal with a hammer. He was an artisan, but he was using a technique that Teku had never seen before. For the moment, he preferred not to bother him. For the moment, he yeah, and I don't have fire. Because I just came from where it's really rainy. That man was pounding a piece of metal with a hammer. He was an art. Okay, so it's still not, I've got to do something else before it will let me bother him. I just want to torment the guy. Say, dude, what you up to? See, that thing is attracted to... the flame. But of course, I'm back to just... Whoa! Because there's I'll just move that over there. Just for fun. It's kinda of bugging me that it's out. I'm honestly thinking that if I light this. That I can get that bug to come down, but it won't stay lit with the rain. Oh, I'm an idiot. Well, no, actually, I'm not an idiot because before I had the monkey and I couldn't light that. So now I don't have the monkey, so I can light this. And it should maybe Nope Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna light the other ones just yet But I need some sort of digging tool. That's not what I wanted to do. I really wish you could, you know, cover up the flame. see whether or not it's actually covered for a little bit because I it didn't dim out nope it did 
when I used that little pulse, it must have gone out. Nothing left to do there, because that got rid of the one monkey. I still have to figure out how to get rid of the other monkeys. We're going to jump in this dude's mouth. We have to figure out how to get that down. Because that might be a mushroom garden, who knows. I'm thinking that gem might have something to do with it. But usually the puzzles... ...have, uh... ...clues other places around. Um... So I just have to figure out where the clue is to has on how to milk a tree. it's a sequence of five but the problem is is there's a lot of different sequences it could be Unless I want to try every single sequence. Which, you know, is a viable option, but it's not, you know, the most fun to watch. And then there's also that thing that's up there bobbing, like an old fashioned water bird. like yeah whatever and I don't have anything to dig mushrooms I think this is to give her oh no this is her story what the pinyin
What the pinyan? So she makes mushroom soup. That's helpful. Hmm. And the candle goes out just as Darkness I get there again. Was immense. Tekka would need his candle to be burning to go on. And I think I'm going to have to get a more powerful candle. There's a thing up on top of the cave, but I can't do anything with it. I can't reach it. Hmm, hmm, hmm. A piece of bark with a curious shape was peeling off what was left of the tree. At the moment, Teku had no interest in it. Maybe I should have an interest in it. And that is just to save. in something here could be a brain I don't know <laughs> I'm betting that the the artisan is going to have like some sort of candle holder for me. That will allow me to deal with the rain. Because the fact that there's all this rain kind of bugging me. Oh no. Almost as much as my inability to jump. a piece of metal with a hammer. He was an artisan, but he was using a technique that Teku had never seen before. I swear that's Anthony Hopkins. For the moment, Hopkins. he preferred not to bother him. Yeah, I can't do anything with that. I don't have flame, so I can't light that. I mean, if I could light that, I think that would... Because then I could jump on the bellows, I could make things all light up.
I mean, the one thing that really strikes me about this game, all, other than the fact that, you know, I'm brain dead when it comes to some of the puzzles, most of the puzzles. Yes, my son just said that. Um, is the fact that we've got so many games nowadays that are total, they're totally CG. You know, computer generated, you know, bright colors, most of them look a lot alike. And this has such a different art style. It's got the, the watercolors. Um, and it just looks totally different. I'm going to wait till this guy jumps up, see if I can get something else from behind him. I doubt it, because, you know, I already got the one hot pepper, or yellow pepper. But we'll see. Come on. I just don't want him to flatten me. Come on, you can do it. Jump! That's why the monkey has a dog face. Nope, nothing there. You can't do anything there with the coconuts. can't light that candle because rain. And as soon as you step out here, candles kaput. Maybe just maybe. Nope. Of course, I'm wondering how that. I mean, I know how all the steam is building up, but I blocked the hole. Yeah, come on, you can drop down. There we go. Maybe just maybe? No, because if What happens if I shut that? I doubt the steam is going to be able to do anything to heat that up enough to light it. I, that's probably just going to light this area up down here. It's got to be something to do, since I haven't done... It's probably something super simple. And when I figure it out, I'm going to be like, oh, I'm an idiot. Because... Admittedly, I can be. Come 
Come on. But that bug keeps popping up with a little light signal or symbol or candle signal. Symbol. Mesmerized by the light of the flash, the strange insect turned to Teku. There we go. That's what I thought. Mesmerized by the light of the flash. Okay. So things have got to be done in a very precise order. Oh, so, okay, so it lit the one up top, too. Sweet. Not that, you know, I need that one lit. See, it's the, those stupid little things. Smurf berries? Fossilized seed. Well, I think we know where we're planting this. Maybe we'll just use it as a tool to dig there? I don't know. We have escaped. We'll go back down uh, to where the mushroom woman is. I tell you, I really want to figure out how to milk this tree. On that part of the ground, the earth was very damp and disturbed. It would be easy to dig there with the right tools. So I still don't have the right tool. Okay, that's just her story. Hmm. 
you know, sometimes they have clues. You know, in the first act, there were several clues to the... the puzzles. Scattered, you know, they were actually like little drawings in the background. Um... But I'm not seeing any. Am I interested in this piece of bark yet? Nope. Jump in this dude's mouth. Nothing in here. Well, yet. And if I do that, I'm going to die falling down. I'm wondering what that thing is still there for. I'm pretty sure it, it would kill me if I tried to get near it. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's an exercise in futility. Yes, let's light a candle and have it go out immediately. There's still no flame up here and no way to get a flame up here. Can I disturb him now? No! I'll disturb him with my thud. And nope, he's still just banging away, going, hmm, I wonder what that was. Someone, someone seems to have painted the floor of my cave red. What's that about? That man was pounding a piece of metal with a hammer. Yep. That man was pounding a piece of metal with a hammer. He was an artisan. He's still pounding away, and I can't access that. I'd like to be able to, like, stick something in that, back up the water, and have him, you know, start yelling at me to get off his front porch, but that doesn't work. Yep, and you just die if you fall off that way. Which is fine, because, you know, you have to test every way you can die. But honestly, I have died a bunch today. It's been fun. I've enjoyed dying. But I think what I'm going to do is I am going to bang my head 
against trying to milk a tree. But since I know that that is, you know, not something that people are going to want to watch on the stream, I will do that on my own. So, this is TG Ace of Hearts. This is Candle, Power of the Flame. Yeah, that sounds about right. Uh, it's by Teku Studios. Um, Merge Games, I believe, is the PR company behind it. Um, it came out about a week or so ago. Um, this is the second act of the game. Uh, so you do have to do a whole bunch more before you even get to this spot that explains what Teku is doing and what he's looking for and trying to save his people and what the whole power of uh, the flames about um, and the Wachichu the Wachu people, their uh, enemies um, but anyway I will be on tomorrow I haven't decided what I'm going to stream but until then have a good one I'll catch you later Thank you.